Runway status lights combine airport lighting equipment with airport surveillance systems to create an additional layer of runway safety. This automatic system helps increase situational awareness by determining vehicle and aircraft locations. Red in-pavement lights illuminate when it's not safe to enter, cross, or begin takeoff on a runway. These lights are designed to reduce the number of runway incursions without interfering with normal and safe airport operations. It is important to understand that runway status lights only indicate a runway status. They do not indicate clearance to proceed onto or across a runway. Runway entrance lights, also known as REL's, are red and located where a taxiway intersects a runway. REL's illuminate when an aircraft is landing or taking off on a runway. The red lights indicate it is not safe to enter the runway environment. REL's go off just prior to the aircraft reaching the taxiway intersection. This allows air traffic controllers to use anticipated separation and keep the normal flow of traffic moving on the airport surface. Pilots must stop at the runway hold line and remain stopped when the REL's are on. You should remain clear of the runway any time the REL's are illuminated. When the air traffic control tower issues a clearance to cross or proceed onto the runway, the entrance lights should not be illuminated or should go out by the time the controller finishes their transmission. Do not enter a runway without an ATC clearance, even if the entrance lights have gone out. Runway status lights only visually verify a controller's clearance. They do not act as a substitute for an ATC clearance. There may be times while waiting for a controller's clearance that you see the entrance lights turn on and off for several cycles. If an air traffic controller gives a clearance and the REL's are illuminated, do not cross over the red lights. Contact ATC and advise that you are stopped due to red lights. If your aircraft is already across the runway hold line when the lights illuminate, you should proceed using your best judgment and contact ATC as soon as possible. Takeoff hold lights, also referred to as THLs, are red and located on a runway's takeoff hold area. THLs are illuminated when an aircraft is in position on a runway's takeoff hold area and an aircraft or vehicle is on the runway somewhere in front of it. THLs turn off when the aircraft or vehicle is exiting the runway and is no longer a hazard to the departing aircraft. Like REL's, THL's indicate runway status. They do not substitute for an ATC clearance. You must wait for an ATC clearance to begin a takeoff roll. It is possible that you may observe several cycles of THLs while numerous aircraft or vehicles cross the runway downfield. If a controller issues a takeoff clearance and the THLs are illuminated, you should not begin the takeoff roll and should advise ATC that you are holding for red lights. If you have begun the departure roll and then observe illuminated THLs, you should abort the departure if it is safe to do so. If it is unsafe to abort the departure, you should proceed according to your best judgment, understanding that the lights are indicating the runway is unsafe for takeoff. In all of these cases, advise ATC as soon as possible of your actions.